enjoy your ideas. Thanks. And I wish that they could practically obtain. But I am concerned with the coarsening of society, media, and I'm talking about television where there's yes. sex in every program. I'm not that I'm opposed to that, but just the <laughs> flaunting of it uh, seems a little bit much. Yeah. And there is also a distinct difference between small town America, rural America, and urban America. And I've been in both places. I mentioned to, uh, well, he's not here, the, the uh, young lady, is it Andrea? That you would be ideal for Alaska, where people are totally dependent on each other for surviving the dreadful winters. Here we are coddled, and we are told how wonderful we are. and. There just seems to be a degeneration of any kind of principle, purpose, or what have you. Am I way out of line by saying something like that? No, I don't think you're way, way out of line, but I think geographically you may have misplaced things a little <laughs> bit. Um, it, 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 it seems to me that um, you know, the, what I have to say, if anything, pertains uh, even more to um, uh, you know, our urban centers where you know, the, the blighting of neighborhoods, the loss of neighborhood structures, uh, the kind of care and concern that people evince for one another, where that's really taken a hit. And, and I think that, that, you know, in ways that we, again, tend not to acknowledge until it's broken, you know, we've, re we've relied heavily on those, again, those kinds of networks um, to help to sustain people and to uh, help them to uh, preserve their dignity, achieve and preserve, you know, achieve a certain recognition as a dignified human being and sustain that over time and so forth. So I don't think that it's, you know, I don't think it's a rural urban, uh, I wouldn't uh, characterize it in that, in that particular way. Um, uh, the, I think the, the, the aspects of depletion uh, that we've been talking about are evident in all kinds of places. And you noted television, well, you know, the small American town is not immune to the influence of, of the media. And I think that the, the, the sort of turning inward, you know, that television often involves, just like kids now get absorbed in video games and will do it for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours and hours yeah. until, until they're stopped is an obsessive thing. Um, and what does that do? That privatizes, that encloses, that, that leads people to be less social, less engaged with others. So I think all of those media, if we include, if we include not just television, but all the other oh, yeah. modalities of distraction, that, that all of that is deeply problematic in light of what, I, what it is I had to say. Now, how you deal with that and put the genie back into the bottle is a real challenge. We tried in the call to civil society, we made some recommendations about television, about restoring the sort of family hour notion where certain kinds of things are not displayed on television in a certain period of time every evening so that children, you know, school age children are not subjected to this since so many parents don't seem to have the good sense to, you know, to make sure their kids aren't subjected to it. But I don't, I think it's fair to say that didn't go anywhere. Um, so, you know, it's very difficult to, you know, to, um, to think of how to deal with this, this Per, this pervasiveness, this intrusion. I mean, it's, you know, at one point you could think of perhaps of certain zones, uh, if you will, that were not totally invaded by the outside world. And, and now that's very difficult because the family itself, obviously, and our most intimate relations are just invaded, pervaded with modern media. And I think we, you know, we, we, we don't often, um, don't seem to have the means, and I don't quite understand why, to just say it stays off, you know? Or there's, or there's a few, you know, you have a certain number of hours a day to a child, you can watch it, and, and we're gonna monitor what it is. There are some things you can't, can't watch, and so forth. That, that's within the realm of the humanly possible. Why don't, you know, why don't we do that? And, um, well, I have some thoughts on why we don't do that, but let me stop. But I, I think okay. you're, you're, you're onto something very important and something that's really frustrating to think about because it's very hard to know how to, how to handle it, you know, very hard.